Hey everybody, this is CM Dragonfly here for more Final Fantasy IV on Steam. Last part, Kane betrayed us, and now here we're exiting out, exiting out our underground underworld. Here we go. Dig our way out. What you want to do is go to Mesidia, which is here. I believe, yeah. We knew you would return. Please join us at the Tower of Honor. Worship. Ownership. There. I said worship. One born of a dragon. Bearing darkness and light. Will rise to the heavens. Over the still land. The moon's light eternal. Brings a promise to earth. With bounty and grace. Everyone let us pray. Now is the time to make the legend come true. You see the monkeys praying at the top. Huh. What is this? Look, our prayers, they have been answered. It's the lunar whale. And that is one huge whale. There is no doubt, that is the great and glorious vessel itself, the Lunar Whale. My god, I love this music, this soundtrack, just so glorious, just wait until we get on it. A strange voice addressed me during our prayers, it told me you are to fly to the moon. And that someone awaits you there. Both, but we how can we possibly get there? On the lunar whale, according to our ancient Mesidian documents, there is a crystal inside the ship that allows navigation between here and the moon. We must communicate with it. I'll see what I can do. Just right off the bat, I change Cecil's arm equipment to power arm amulet instead of diamond. And as for Rydia, I change it to rune um, change it back to rune armor and green bear. And it's just Cecil and Rydia, that's it. And both of Edge and Rose's equipment still there. See, look at that shiny crystal! Me wanty! That is some great graphic design, wow.
but we don't want to go to the moon. Wait. Hold on. I'm missing something. We don't want to go there. Instead, we want to go head back to the Tower of Babel. That's where Cain is heading, along with Goldbeds. Let's head there right now. Okay, where's the Tower of Babel? Should be here. Where am I missing? Such an idiot box. You're supposed to go to the moon and go visit every spot here, get every treasure chest here, and meet our final party member. How dumb am I? God. Okay, let's get, go to the cave. Western Lunar Path, okay. Monsters, oh god. Akrolat, what are they? Better cover Holy crap, it does 700 damage to Edge. Oh my god. Let's try to buy it. Let's play one. Oh god, oh no. Thank you, Sizzle, for covering him up. Yes. Flame on. Oh boy, this is gonna be a long fight. Let's do splits on him. You son of a bitch, you, your attack hit Edge. Here's the next potion. Thank you. What do we have? A golden apple. Yes. 
Say that for later. Dark grenade of his Sorry, that was my leg twitching. Oh, it's absolutely pure, everyone. everybody too. You know, I might be skipping these fights, so when I get go see a random encounter again, I'm skipping the fight, okay? Like I usually do, haha. Uh -huh. Thank you. And we're done. Oof, catch game on 39. Stardust, Lunar Curtain. We're on the moon. I'm s going to set this fight. Oh boy, see aliens on the moon yet again. Either skip, edit them out, or run away from them. I think run away is better. Huh. It's like going to a maze. Yeah, and I'm running late. Get rid of these enemies here. Huh. Damn it. Holy shit. Where's a... You bring the video back to me. Here we are. The Babel. Look alike. Let's go in. Welcome. And who's this? You are? I am Forsoya. My duty is protect the slumber of the Lunarans. The Lunarans. Many years ago, a small planet between Mars and Jupiter was on the verge of destruction. Inhabitants escaped an, a ship to the Bloom planet. The what? I'm referring to your Earth. Take me to your leader. However, they were in the midst of revolving, so they created a moon where they could sleep long slumber. So that's where the Lunarians come from. However, there was one of who refused to sleep. Instead, he wished to raise everything on the blue planet to create a new home there. How awful. I was able to seal him away with my powers and force him into a deep sleep. But in spite of this, he was able to challenge the, his evil into the corrupt inhabitants of your planet. Now he uses them to gather the crystals. 
Then he must be the one behind Golbez's actions. Who is this lowlife? His name is Zemus. He is gathering the crystals our energy source to activate the dimensional elevator in the giant babble. Then he tends to destroy everything on your planet. No! However, many of us feel we can come to an understanding with the people of Earth. You know, Vegeta. PEOPLE OF EARTH! <coughs> Excuse me. Those Lunarans are merely sleeping, waiting for your people to reach the right level of evolution. What about the Lunar Wheel? That was built years ago by my younger brother, Kluya, as transportation to the Blue Planet. He had always dreamed of visiting the Lunar The Devil's Road airship technology were also born from his desire to explore. Wow. On Blue Planet, Kuya fell in love and had two children. You are one of his children. Me, then the voice I heard on Mount Ordeals was... The voice came from the soul of Kuya, your father. I see it now. You resemble him when he was your age. That was the voice of my father. Receive power from Kuya to stop Zemus and his evil plan. You must do this for your own planet, for all Lunarans. Uh. You must hurry to the Tower of Babel and Ablon. Sorry, that's my soda. The Tower of Babel, how will I get around its barrier? I should be able to enter. We cannot let the giant Babel reach the blue planet. I will join you on your journey. Yep, well, so I join a team. Alright. Uh, he has, wow, a lot of magic. White magic. Black magic. See his stats. Level 50, wow. Strength 10, agility 20, stamina 10, spirit 60, intellect 45, attack 3 times 50, wow, oh my god. His stats are incredible. Accuracy 72%, defense 2 times 28%, evasion 28%, ev magic of defense 3 times 24, magic evasion 35%. Wow. A good party member in our team. Ah, oh, thanks. This is here. Get out of here. No, we're not going there. We're not going in here. Jeez, why do I sound so gibberish? Jeez, my accent? My puberty? No, hell no, we're not going there. Fine. No, no, great. Edge. Collapse. <sighs> Life. Yeah, I decided to stop using cuts from this video to just run away from enemies because that would be a waste of time.
this Let's get out of here I'll meet you back on the ship. I'm back. Okay, let's head to Earth. Had a slight cold, but I'm... Good. Ah, the tower. We are too late. What do you mean too late? The giant babble will come forth. Appears to be a, of a giant transformers. I like how it turns into Dark Samus. Oh no, Dark Samus is firing his lasers. That doesn't look like it from the PSP version I played last time. Yeah, it's kind of different. No! Damn it. Is there nothing we can do? What's that? Weird. Dwarven tanks ready to fire. We will fight alongside you for the planet, our home. Lolly Hall. And they jump. Yes. I could not lie in bed and leave the responsibility to fight to my friends. Now with my help, this that'll be a clinch. All engines to full power. Yes, sir. Hey, all miss me? Shut up, Palin. The Belder restored us. You should not fight this battle alone. We all must fight for the sake of our survival. I will fight with you, Cecil, with the courage you have given me. So that's basically Transformers. In a fantasy nutshell, wow. Now is our chance to enter the giant babble. I get it, we're going for the core, it's hard. Sid. Approach its mouth. Who is he? Fusoya, a lunarin. He's a lunarin? Can you do this or not? Ah, keep your beard on. There's nothing I can't do. 
Old man versus old man. Okay. Hedge for his mouth. Now, hang on. Okay. There's no turning back. Let's head for. Well, go best. Alright, these new enemies Me Beamer, Mecha Soldier, Bolter. Let's keep the party alive. So you cure them. This Demigon radio. Well, this stinks. Apparently, I'm going to have to run away from them eventually after I get all the best areas. This is what it looks like inside of a giant, well, armor alien thing. New enemy here, Searcher. Uh, Edge, you attack with the Searcher. Everybody else attack the robots. Damn it! Phoenix Yes, done to Keeping me alive by using soda, the maximum energy of what a droid would look like. Yep. Let's keep the 
party line. to equip him. Uh, where is it? C, black cow, yes. Very good. Chest contain high potion. This just contains an ether. And running away. Siren, okay. Giant soldier, that I want. Throw a Kanaya. Great, we don't have experience for this here. Well, that's got the party level right now. Cecil is level 50. Radius level 48. Edge is level 40. And Rose is level 50. Okay. Just give him some dry ethers. Okay. Wait, what is that? Skipping ahead. to go there. Annoying encounters. So much wrong. Perfect. Ah. Oh, now is not the time.
this? Monsters. Jesus. It's a new kid. But instead, let's have for Soya have a meteor. Thunder, lightning, thunder. All right, use medium. Takes a while for the meteor spell to come in for a few seconds or a minute, which is really fine. Ah, oh, I just wanted to do my meteor spell on him. Elixir, I'm I am saving that for the final boss. Who's this? Now I didn't press Q R W, just two and three. Jeez. Both together. Okay. Here's a tent here. Let's keep going. What's this? Welcome, what can I do for you? Oh cool. Let's buy a shirt. Yeah. And Arctic Lights. That'll be coming handy. Uh, I better go train. I'll meet you when everybody is in level 60 or so. Be right back. Hey, I'm back. I trained everybody to level 60, including Edge. Um, I did have, however, leveled Rydia and have her stats increase. Yeah, so she learned a lot of magic, black magic, which is see, flare, quake, and meteor, and also for Suya. She learned Rosa learned Fold Life and Holy. Encourage her. That keeps everything better. Let's continue. You have come at last, Rosa Rubicante. You cannot stop the giant of Babel. Ha ha ha, now is the time for the death of all for real. That looks like a Jawa right there behind us. No offense. Element, elemental lords, indeed. Master Zemus bless us with a second love. Prepare to die. I shall enjoy fighting you again. You have taught us of the power that comes from joining forces. That is what we all do. Now allow me to restore your strength. Okay, how generous of you all. Oh, for you. This time we shall prevail. Oh, 
Okay, he's allergic to fire, so... What I want to do is cast a trip. Everybody just hits him. Yeah, Brady, I used Hellfire. Shit. Using the curse. Slowing down. Use Itrophil. All you have to do is use fire attacks on your elemental ward, and you'll be dead real quickly. Suggest using flame attacks like flame or flare on them. Now he's changed into that turtle. Look at him. He looks like Emotep, except he's a water elemental and he has a sh turtle shell attached to it. Yeah, I heard of that from the movie Nightmare Brandon Fraser. It's hilarious. I don't know about you all, but them, that. Remake of that in Mario 2017 was really done with Tom Cruise in it. So done. Let's try holding it. Let's see what. Phase, which is Twister. No. Is that his name? That's her name? I forget. Yeah, I forget. Keep doing all you've got. Let's use a holy strike on it. Yeah, come on. 
Avatar. Yes! For a second I thought my party's gonna be dead. Cure job. Please don't heal, please don't heal. Come on. Oh, thank goodness. Master Zimas, please one last chance. We have failed again. 